Okay guys, so today we are taking a look at what has just become probably my favorite uh, Bluetooth speaker and the reason for that would be the crazy array of colors and the extremely loud volume that is possible. So let's go over what the actual box is or what it looks like so that I can get that out of the way and the packaging material because I'm impressed with how they package this just because it come very very well packaged so the box here says uh, dream speaker in fantasy colors and it gives you some of the different examples of the colors on the side um, on this back side here it has information uh, mobile phone tablet mp3 mb4 PC TF card uh, 8 hour rechargeable lithium ion battery and built-in LED light show that pulses to your music has a, a picture of the actual uh, speaker here the technical specs 100 Hertz to 200 or uh, sorry 100 Hertz to 20 uh, kilohertz 80 decibel and 2 by 5 watt inside the box is a portable stereo speaker with LED lighting one audio cable and one USB cable and of course you have the website and the QR code uh, right here and in some of the certifications and recycling type uh, information on the side so other than that not a lot to see um, as far as like I said packaging I mean it comes with this little box that has the cable for charging which is your standard micro USB cable um, I've already started charging it but I use my own cables so that one's still wrapped up and I'll move this box out of the way a little piece here that was on the top didn't need that really so this was a little foam cylinder in a bag of course the bag was around the speaker the speaker was inside the cylinder so you had this nice foam padding in addition and then of course the main box was inside of a larger box so all together a good deal of padding not gonna have to worry too much about shipping damages uh, being very likely you have your um, audio cable which I've used and tested and I've also tested the SD card and it, it just everything works great I uh, love this little speaker you have a multi uh, language user manual and it basically is there's not a lot to it I mean it's very simple you have your let's see if I can zoom in and make it easier alright so you have your on and off switch here you have your little card reader here of course it's spring loaded for a little micro uh, SD card your auxiliary end which you'll use with this cable that's included you have your charging port and you have your charging indicator on the bottom just a nice rubberized base a little bit of a foot on it we scroll uh, spin it around here on this side the other side and what you have here is your mode button uh, as you press this you can choose between auxiliary uh, Bluetooth and your micro SD card if, if there is one inserted you have your volume advanced to uh, maximum and when you do that you will have an indicator that will beep to indicate you have your track um, you know you can adjust going back and forth on the track on either side of the play and pause button which is also if you're uh, getting a phone call your answer and hang up button then you have your volume down button and then you have your different light mode selection and I think this thing said it has eight different light modes or five different light modes five different light modes so that's pretty cool so what I wanted to do basically uh, the top of it just is the name with another rubberized piece and this is more like a mesh almost like a almost like a screen and then you have this nice rubber texture coating everything including this one piece here where it says fantasy color so let's zoom back out just to make it a little easier to see alright so let's flip this thing on alright and I believe that may be in Bluetooth mode at the moment um, so you know it does mp3s, WMA, WAV file, APE uh, FLAC audio so that's nice to know it has a 4800 milliamp rechargeable battery and as I said you can connect it um, you know with the uh, auxiliary so if you don't want to use that 
uh, six hours is the charge time it's red and then green when fully charged red when charging working time eight hours so impressive the weight of it actually has a nice you know pretty sturdy weight to it and although it's a cylinder it's pretty steady it's not gonna knock over very easily um, um, overall I'm just impressed with this unit so basically um, let's actually see it work because that's what makes it cool and let's see let's do YouTube and let's see let's just pull up the video <laughs> And if you turn this down, it will ding. That's basically at the mute level. There's no volume really coming out. I can't hear anything. And if we turn it up a little bit, you can see the light pulsing to the music. I'm going to go ahead and flip this light, give you a better look at this thing. All right. So we have this little uh, 2015 C7 Corvette. All right. So... I want to change the lighting effects to show you guys some different lighting effects. But imagine if a car existed with the emotion, the beauty, and aggression of the Italian kings still at the same price point. So you can see it cycles through colors as it's bouncing up and down the unit. And then we have one where it kind of just cycles through some different colors. This thing really looks awesome. <laughs> I just, I think it'd be great at night. The performance of this car isn't just impressive. All right, another mode there. It makes you ask yourself, how in the world can they possibly improve this? How can and I think the camera's picking up a lot more of the white light because of the uh, auto correction, but you can still see the multiple colors and how it keeps shifting. It's actually very cool. All right, and then there, of course, you can turn the light off and you can still listen to the audio. This car now, I just nothing else matters. The I audio is very clear, very clear. And then, of course, you have some of the other colors that it had not cycled through. I like this one just because it's constantly moving. All right, so let's see. I paused it. Let's try a different. Uh, Try a different video here. All right. Now let's do this. All right. Let me crank this up to the maximum volume. All right. So now we're at maximum volume. And. So, as you can hear, that Ferrari sounded really nice. The guy's voice was clear and very loud. Um, I don't want to play music because of all the copyright issues that come about. But, uh, yeah, this thing is really awesome. It's loud. If you were to put this in a setting with multiple people and, you know, you wanted to listen to music and share your music, you're definitely going to be able to do that because of the volume level. Um, whether you're using the auxiliary input, the Bluetooth input, which we were just using, or if you're playing back from the micro SD card, in all ways it functions great. And as I said, with the uh, different lighting effects that you can choose from, the thing is just great. I'm really, really impressed with uh, both the look and the actual feel of it with this, like I said, rubberized feel and the volume level that's able to be uh, gotten is is just nice I mean you can really share your music with a lot of people this is definitely a really cool unit it's got a good weight to it feels good quality um, I don't know I just I'm tickled by this thing I guess so much it's uh, 
it's just fun. I don't.